We're gonna be wrapping these, and then later today we have to go sh clothes shopping for VidCon. <gasps> oh my gosh! Happy Memorial Day, friends! Hope you guys are having a wonderful weekend, spending time with friends and family. I feel like holiday weekends are, you either have something fun planned, or you use the time to catch up on all your shorts and stuff. Yeah. I feel like that's the one or two we've, thing. We've been having a lot of fun this weekend. Yesterday we went boating. Sorry we didn't vlog it, but we'll be going boating a lot more in the future, so we'll make sure yeah. to take you guys along. The other day, we went we shopping, went shopping for baby clothes. For we'll not. show you some of that right now. Yes. You guys, I have, I had $42.33 on this thing. What yeah. a surprise. And we're supposed to be getting baby clothes, but Jess is looking for herself. I'm, okay. Yes, I need some clothes too. Clearly, I'm a little dated on my wardrobe. We're visiting our nephew when we go to California and we have yet to meet him. So I need to impress him with some uh, <laughs> with a good gift. It's a little rain jacket, oh my gosh. I'm dying, you They're guys. They're in San Diego. They don't need rain jackets. What do you mean they don't need rain? Of course he needs a rain jacket. Why you will you... use that one time. Uh, you don't know that. I don't know how fast they grow or anything like that. They grow like weeds. $60 for a shirt thing? For, oh my gosh. And the jacket? Crab. Isn't that cute? You're going to give them crabs? Uh, fine. <laughs> I That's bet he dress. would be more impressed with toys. He's a dude. Not a freaking. Well, yeah, but we're also getting this not for him, for his parents, for my brother. Well, we've already impressed your brother. How? I don't. I don't need to impress my brother. I need to impress Knox. I'm gonna be the favorite aunt. But Knox will be impressed that... by toys, not by pretty clothes. <laughs> He's not even gonna remember anything, so I want to get a cute picture with him. <laughs> oh, so this is all about you. <laughs> it's not even about Knox. <laughs> no, I want to get. Why don't you just say what you're feeling, babe? Cute. Is this for a boy? I, I don't know if that's for a boy or a girl. I don't think anything these days is for boys or girls anymore. <sighs> is that a weird thing to think about? Like, with all this gender equality stuff? What we really need to get Knox isn't clothes, isn't toys. What he really needs is cardboard boxes, because we all know parents or always a complain. Star robe! They all stopped. That is. Oh wow! <laughs> Holy cow! I know. Don't don't you just want to cuddle up the little one in this? Now that you say that, yeah, I do. Just go ahead, and cuddle, cuddle. No, no. Nope. Cuddle it. No. Nope. Just put your arm around it. Come no. on. Just no. hug it. Hug <laughs> it. He can be a little sock monkey. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. Oh my lord, I'm gonna need to get oh. two jobs just to when we have a kid. And that's what grandparents are for. <laughs> And this is what I got. It's super cute. Like, he's gonna be like a little dinosaur lover or something. I don't know. Aww. It makes me want to have a little baby. Oh, stop. <laughs> Jeez. No, but this one's my favorite. This one. Knox, thing. you're causing troubles already. We haven't even met you. Wear it with a bunch of different shirts underneath. I know. These or something. It's super cute. I'm super pumped to meet Knox. We're gonna be going there after. Well, we're going to California for VidCon, but we're going to meet Knox following VidCon. We're gonna for go down. First Time. For the first time. That's so weird to think. I'm an, I'm an uncle. Today, we're gonna try and take advantage of some of the Memorial Day sales, and we're gonna go clothes shopping, because we have VidCon coming up here this next month. Guys, it's almost freaking June. We're gonna be wrapping these, and then later today, we have to go sh clothes shopping for VidCon. <gasps> oh my gosh! Holy crap! Oh my gosh! Holy dang, okay, um, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. That was scary. What happened? Our microwave caught fire. No way. Yeah, for real. My sister the other day was telling me that the microwave had caught fire yeah. and I didn't believe her. And sure enough, holy dang, it was like, that was flaming. You guys saw. I can't. What the fuck? I mean. Oh my gosh.
gosh. You need to stay away from the kitchen. No. <laughs> now you're cracking jokes. Oh my gosh. So my, Ooh, yeah, don't hot. touch it. It was just on fire. My sister called me the other day. Oh my gosh, I am shaking. My sister called me the other day and was telling me that she was cooking using our microwave and it like caught fire and I didn't believe her. I just thought it was like a spark or something because she had left something in the microwave that maybe she wasn't supposed to. But no, that legit, that Jeez. caught fire. That is How did... crazy. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Well, <laughs> I'm happy I like caught that before it got too bad. Yeah, okay. Well, I think it's probably time we go get a new microwave, yeah? How did that happen? I don't know, I was just cooking popcorn and it freaking ignited. Ooh. Yeah, that's crazy. How'd you? I am shaking. How do you know to use baking soda? I've gone through cooking class in high school. <laughs> Come you? on. Yeah. Like that's not like common knowledge. I'm impressed. Come on. Come on. Give me a little bit Dang. of credit. Dang, that's scary. Okay. I need to like gather my thoughts here. I'm beyond shaky. That was scary. <laughs> Word to the wise. Smoky. Yeah, let's open up some windows. Holy crap. Yeah, I know. I know, honey. This is warm. Isn't that crazy? You're never allowed in the kitchen again. Yeah. I can't believe that just happened. I legit was only cooking popcorn and it just like caught and went. But we've been like, we've experienced problems with this microwave a while ago. Like it was sparking underneath, uh, you had like a plate or had, something, right? I had, well, it did it with this thing, this, just one of these plates. It would just do a little bit of spark, but yeah. nothing like. And we thought it was the plates, so we stopped using no, those plates. No. We thought it was a ceramic. Yeah, but it only happened like a couple times and it was never bad. And, and then it would stop. Yeah. I don't know. Either way, I'm happy that nothing really bad happened because that could have easily caught our house on fire. So, wow. That was like a close call. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I need to like go chill. I'm, that's crazy. I've never in my life experienced a fire in the house. That was just scary. Have you learned your lesson? Yes, yes I have. <sighs> never use crappy microwaves, even after someone warns you about them. Our mic, well, no, our microwave's not crappy, but you need to just stay out of the kitchen. That's... <laughs> Gosh, I come inside to a freaking almost burned down house? Goodness. Oh man, you always hear of house fires, and house fires are no joke. Like, people lose everything. And just to think that like, that could have gotten way out of hand way fast if I wasn't here in this room, like... <sighs> Scary what to think. Anyway. Uh, to kind of clear our heads and kind of like move on from this, uh, we need to go shopping. So we weren't planning on it, but definitely need to go get a new microwave and maybe afterward, maybe do some clothes shopping. I don't know. Luckily though, today is Memorial Day, so hopefully we can get some like appliance on the cheap because money's a little tight. Anyway, let's get going. We could go for the tiny little $59 <laughs> one. Oh my gosh, at these prices we might have to. This one's not too bad. Th that's not a... We need one that goes over the range Oh though. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I didn't know microwaves are so expensive. The more you know. I'm not thrilled about the fact that we need to 
get any microwave now. I know. Although, like, I'm not mad at you. I'm just, like, frustrated with the fact. Yeah. But I guess that comes with having a house. That one looks good. Is that one over the... It's over the range. I don't know what any of that means. <laughs> $210 later. 203 203 Still more money than I wanted to spend on uh, appliances ever. <laughs> I'm ready to be done with this microwave and just close shop. All I can think of is what I'd rather spend my money on than a microwave. That's the only thing I can think of right now, but oh well. That's, that's what you get for having a home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, adult life. It's a trap. If you're not yet out on your own, don't. Did some quick shopping. Just got a few things, but do you want to show them later? Uh, yeah, we can do that. I always feel weird filming in shopping. In like a clothing store when yeah. You're trying on clothes yeah. Because other people are trying on clothes. I don't like to make people feel super uncomfortable, so I don't like to like I don't like to film in dressing rooms. I guess. Yeah, that was weird. But the good news is, while she was trying on clothes, I was actually able to find a better deal on the microwave. That is, uh, that's no good. That was probably close to 10 years old. It probably was here when the house was built. I don't care. I've known of microwaves since the 60s that still operate no. just fine. That's just, that should yeah, never but happen. Yeah, these days, things don't mess with them. Don't. They just don't build them like they used to. I hope that never happens ever again. So, thanks so much for hanging out. We're gonna watch or finish watching Guardians of the Galaxy. And uh, I'll show any... you my clothes next time. I'm too tired to try all those clothes on again. <laughs> we'll have like a shopping haul because we're not done shopping. So maybe we'll go shopping a few more times, and then at the end of it, we'll just have one big shopping haul. So yeah, there you go. See you guys next time. Good night. <laughs>